What is going on everyone? Hope all of you are doing well. So I have to redo my Bride of Chucky review because apparently YouTube took it down. They stated that it violated the guidelines. Not sure what it violated. There was no really, no, no explanation. So I went ahead and deleted the video and I will be redoing that review. Also, apparently my mic is having issues, some feedback issues, so that is why I am holding it for the time being to see if the audio on this video does well with me holding it rather than clipping it on my shirt. So we'll see what happens there. So The Bride of Chucky, this came out in 1998 and is the fourth uh, film in the Chucky franchise. and. The direction they went to, you can tell they started going with that comedic route. Um, thankfully, just this film and Cedar Chucky were the only two films we would get that were more towards the comedy, even though there is horror. Um, of course, Curse of Chucky would kind of revamp itself and go back to that darker tone like the first other three in the franchise um the bride of chucky we have jennifer tilly as chucky's wife or girlfriend when he was human and of course him and tiffany decide to wreak havoc tiffany is played by uh, jennifer tilly who never seems to age at all uh, i thought her performance was great now i will state this i kind of felt like this film didn't really need to Tiffany, and at times they could have done something a little bit better, but over the years this film surprisingly has gained a cult following. There are fans who love this film, and of course there's fans who don't really care for this movie. Uh, now there are a lot of familiar faces. We've got Katherine Heigl, you know, earlier in her career, and when, of course we got the late great John Ritter. Uh, we get a nice little reference to Hellraiser, as well as some of the other horror franchise slasher films like uh, Friday the 13th, Halloween, A Nightmare on Elm Street. We get a reference to the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So there's some really cool, you know, other horror references. But all in all, this film is pretty decent for what it is. Um, it's not one of my personal favorites. Yes, I will watch this movie from time to time, but it's not one I tend to revisit often. Not like the other uh, three films in the franchise. But nonetheless, The Bride of Chucky is a pretty fun film for what it is. And it's definitely worth a watch in my personal opinion. But that's my review and thoughts on the film. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. I am Film Talk with Mikey. And until next time, we'll talk films. Peace.